Hey there, today I will show you the most supportive shoes that I own for travel where I am going to be walking all day. They have rugged soles for walking on cobblestone roads in any weather. You will have solid footing by walking with these shoes when you travel. I hope to help you get off on the right foot by following these travel tips. So let's jump into the video. The number one shoe that I pack is a waterproof hiking shoe. Rugged sole provides traction for solid footing while walking all day on uneven pavement or on a hike like I did in Montana. They have lower waterproof hiking shoes too, like my old one, but mine is not waterproof. This is the new one that is waterproof. And it is a light gray color, which I think blends more beautifully with blue denim or your khaki pants that you'll be wearing. But it can also be worn with your water resistant pants that you have packed as well. Merrill insoles are like wearing a sneaker so I can walk all day in them. I wear them with denim or with my hiking pants. Most of these shoes are waterproof for your travel needs because a lot of us are traveling in between seasons. As a pilot's wife for over 20 years, I've had to pack in only a carry-on suitcase. So choosing the most comfortable and supportive shoes that will match with the most amount of outfits is very important to me and I've learned some of these tips along the way. If you are going to Alaska or Iceland or somewhere like that, one tip is to wear those water resistant pants over your jeans or your leggings and that way your, the base layer is protected. Another shoe that is really comfortable and completely waterproof is this one. I know it will sell out. The sole is rugged. So if you have uneven pavement when you're touring, uh, cobblestone roads even, it will also help you have sure footing. The zipper is very easy, very easy to use as well. This boot is not waterproof at all, but it is gloriously beautiful and comfortable to walk in all day. This boot was available last month, but now it is only available on the Echo site. This is my sneaker that is many years old that many of you have used on your travels. It is water resistant except for the shoelaces, of course, but although it looks metallic green, it's really a neutral when you pair it with denim of different different colors, especially if you like to wear trousers that are like a cotton blend type pant. This shoe is the Echo brand and I love Echo for travel because their sole is like a sneaker. So it gives me that support if I'm touring in a city all day. This metallic green color is no longer available, but they have many colors. But I did not like the white one or the super light blue one because for some reason they fit differently. But sometimes I want to go into a restaurant at night. So that's why the black boot that is waterproof is a good choice because I can wear it with black denim and go into a restaurant and not feel like I'm a slob or not appropriately dressed for that occasion. This is a sneaker that I would use more in the summer. It is so comfortable. I believe the brand is from Australia. I bought it and had it for a few weeks and then uh, travel and leisure, I think, they came out with this is the most, the number one most comfortable shoe. I mean, it's not as comfortable as my Echo shoes, but it's like a sneaker without looking like I'm an American wearing Asics. <laughs> which is what we used to look like in the 90s for sure. This is so comfortable. I love these shoes, especially if you like to wear dresses. I have had this shoe for over four years. I have worn it on gravel roads. I've worn it in the rain in Boston and gotten soaking wet in 45 minutes of pouring rain and they did not ruin. There was just a little bit of my sock up here that got wet and that was after 45 minutes. And Boston does not have any overhang <laughs> to hide under when it is raining. But it also has a sneaker sole. It is very supportive and comfortable, but it's considered, well, on the website, it's a sneaker, and then it's really a short boot. I've worn it to so many soccer games, it really kept my foot warm as well. The new version of this sneaker is a brighter blue, more, much like the color of my suitcase. I bought it so that I could really test it out, but I returned it because I don't need them. 
but they are the exact same shoe. It just looks stiffer because it hasn't been poured on and worn for four years straight. I also like this shoe if I'm wanting to look a little dressier on my vacation, but look at that sole. It is just a wonderful sole and it also has that supportive, comfortable sole for my foot. I got this shoe in hopes of wearing it in Europe barefooted in the late summer because I think it looks so pulled together, but look how supportive that shoe is. It is so comfortable. And I like to pack this type of really cheap insole if I'm going to be going barefooted or if I'm wanting to protect the inside of my shoe. And you can get them at any drugstore. This is the Walmart brand, the Equate, but this is double. I did not notice that I was buying the double one. So if your shoe does not have that much room in it for um, extra padding and thicker socks, if you're wearing boots, uh, do not get the double one, but they're so easy to cut down to your foot size. A lot of the Echo now are letting you pull out the sole and put your own insoles or orthotics in, if that helps. This looks like a heel, but y'all, it is only like a half of an inch and it is so comfortable and still so pulled together. And you could wear it with black jeans, back, black trousers, khaki, blue, or even blue denim. I just think that is a versatile shoe and it is supportive and comfortable. If I'm walking all day, my last waterproof, and these are waterproof, hey, waterproof for the win, but they also have a black version and I have the older black version, which I would not be able to walk all day in, okay? But this is the newer version and it is a lower heel and I love it. Another one is more like a sandal and it's also by the Merrill brand that I trust, but Teva is another brand that is great if you like the sandal style. These hiking sandals are water resistant because I myself have gotten them wet before. They have arch support for walking all day too. And this sandal comes in a light gray color too. These Reef brand sandals are completely waterproof and so supportive. Now here is when I would pack them for a vacation where I have to walk across the street to get to the beach or the pool or the lake. They gave me support for the long walk that we had to make from our condo to our beach in Maui two years ago. Hose all of the sand off of them when you're done with your vacation. One tip is the Velcro is very strong and secure. One travel tip for packing shoes with your travel outfits is to choose shoes that one, go with the activities and the weather that you may have, but also a shoe that is going to blend with your trousers so that it lengthens your look. And for me, a sandal that is tan color is my skin tone in the summer. Um, I would need a bright white one in the winter because my legs are so white. Many of you have your own favorite shoes, so thank you for watching this video, but share your brand of shoes. If you are watching this, look at all of the comments while I'm talking as well. I hope you have a great time wherever you're going and that you have solid footing and that you started out on the right step with my tips. Thanks for your time.